let's go. Hi guys and what is going on? I hope you guys are having a excellent weekend. I know I am. Now one of my subs in my last video uh, asked me what crosshair do I use and where can I get it? And I thought well instead of just you know giving him the command in the description or in the comments sorry uh, what it is. I thought I could do a video about it to make it a little bit more explanatory. So <clears throat> uh, what I used is a um, it was like a map um, called uh, Crosshair Generator V2. It has all the different um, pros and um, challenges, what they use as their own. Um, you can change the color, just whatever. Let's get straight into it. Um, so I'll leave the, li uh, the link of the map in the description so you can just go ahead and click on it and download it. So it's right here. I'm just going to click start. Now, <clears throat> this is a really simple and easy thing. It doesn't require any copying and pasting into the command, nothing like that. It's simple, easily, you know, you choose what you want and you get what you want. It's pretty good. Um, it's one of the best uh, maps I've come across that is good for crosshairs. So we're going to wait for this to load up. Let's go CT. Okay, so as you can see here, we've got the crosshair styles. We've got all the different ones now these ones obviously move so a lot of people i think about 70 percent of the people who play csgo have this one here and pros um they have the one which doesn't move because when it moves it can distract and it can confuse like whether you know where it is because when it moves out obviously it's changing now this is the ebola one as i call it the ebola crosshair because it is just ebola i think summit 1g i think he uses that so i don't know why but um yeah this is the one i would use so i've got my own here so for instance you would shoot that uh, to get yours so I can just demonstrate so if I want that so it shows you the size the thickness the gap the outline the alpha and the dot so you can sort of choose as you can see they're still moving um, a lot of people go with the outline obviously here you can change the uh, the size of the outline minus and plus uh, you can show the target whether it looks like that that or that also here you've got backgrounds which you can just choose from just test it from but um, the crosshair manager is something that you can share the crosshair uh, you can set it back to default or restore your crosshair um, save the crosshair the custom one or load one now here we have got the crosshair generator this is not the main main part of the um, the map or the uh, whatever you want to call it now this is Pasha's so it's got every single person from VP uh, Fnatic uh, Envious, uh, Nip, Titan, Cloud9, Navi, TSM, Pence Sports, uh, Hellraisers, Mouse Sports. It shows you everyone on the team. It shows you all you knew you have to do is literally click it. You got it. It's that simple. Look. You just click what you want and you've got it. And it's really cool. You know, you don't have to do anything. You can just do that. You can test it, uh, and you just click save, and you're done. That's how simple it is. Now, also here, <clears throat> this just shows the top donators. I don't know why I'm looking at this, but yellow. Uh, yeah, here we have, uh, these are some streamers. So Sparkles, as you guys know, Sparkles is a CSGO YouTuber. Uh, Summit 1G, as I said, the Ebola. Like, this is like pure Ebola. I don't know how someone can physically play like this. It moves around too much, and it's just confusing to use. So we've got Hiko. Uh, as you know, uh, the YouTuber, no, sorry, the streamer who is on Team Nvidia. We've got Anders, who is the um, one of the analysts, and also one. Oh no, it's not an analyst. Sorry, he is one of the uh, commentators of CS:GO uh, competitive versus uh, you know all the teams. Blah 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 blah. I'm gonna stop talking now. Uh, yeah, I've got this one. This is the one I'm currently using. I was thinking about switching it up, but um, I'm not too sure. You know, this is V2. I'm not too sure whether V3 will be coming out. Uh, anytime soon, but yeah, so obviously here you can save the crosshair um, I don't really understand this, but I have to look into it, but I'm not too sure But um, yeah, here we've got color black white red yeah, Whatever, you know, I think I would tend to stay with the default. I think it was green because it's you know, it's a light color um, You really want to go with a color, but you know your eyes um, I look like what brights up your eyes, what makes your eyes focus on it, um, <clears throat> if you understand what I mean by that. Um, 
But yeah, anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Like I say, you know, these are all the crosshairs from all the main teams. The top 10 teams. I think there's 10. I'm not counting. I can't be asked. But yeah, hope you guys have enjoyed. Um, but yes, like I say, someone requested this. And I thought I'd make a video about it. Because it seemed much more easier. And, you know, I've given you a, you know, a free thing that you can use for yourself. You know, I don't know if a lot of people know about this. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one.